Hey, welcome to another episode of Music Tips and Reviews with JG. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. Appreciate y'all for tuning in. As I always say, please subscribe to my channel so you'll be updated on all my latest content. Appreciate the love. Appreciate the love. Um, you know, I had 3K now, 3,000 subscribers. So uh, continue to tell people about my channel if you love music. And so y'all know Diddy is back in the news again. Uh, one of his producers that worked on his last album, um, you know, coming out. Uh, this article by uh, Vulture, um, it says Diddy uh, accused of sexual sexual assault by producer Little, Little Rod. Little Rod. <laughs> There's so many lows. <laughs> um, yet another person is stepping forward with sexual assault allegations against Diddy in a lawsuit. Producer Lil Rod, uh, real name Rodney Jones, uh, accuses the the, um, the mogul of drugging, sex trafficking, uh, threatening, and sexually assaulting him for over a year. Uh, NBC, NBC News reported, filed in the U.S. District Court uh, for the South District of New York um, on fe February 26. Um, the 73 page complaint alleges, um, Diddy, real name, Sean Combs, uh, abused, uh, um, Jones while they lived and traveled together from September 2022 to November, um, 2023. And, you know, he, he produced, um, songs off of the new album, um, the love album off the grid, which was nominated. Um, Jones claimed he recorded hundreds of hours of video where Diddy and his inner circle engaged in serious illegal activities. Um, the suit also includes screenshots from parties hosted by Diddy with sex workers and underage girls in attendance, wow, <laughs> who were allegedly giving lace drinks um, at Diddy's uh, behest, <laughs> according to lawsuit review uh, reviewed uh, by Vulture, the following names: um, Diddy's son, Justin, Universal Music Group CEO, um, Lu Lucian Grange. I hope they I'm pronouncing their name right. Um, former former uh, Motown record CEO, Ethiopia. I'm not even going to say her last name, <laughs> but, uh, you know, basically a lot of people is in this lawsuit. And also, this also has to do with uh, Lil Rod. Uh, he didn't get his rightful publishing on the last album. And so, you know, it's a lot going on with that. Um, a lot of people think he's doing this because Cassie did it and she got her money. And, you know, Lil Rod think he's going to get his money, you know. So people think it's, it might be a greed thing. Um, and also, you know, because of the publishing issue, you know, with the last album, you know, he feel like he didn't get, you know, the publishing he deserves. And there's also a video surfacing where um, Diddy and his assistant is like joking over that. And, you know. Lil Rod, uh, he went to go for me to get people support as far as the lawsuit because, you know, Diddy is a, a huge name. Uh, you know, Diddy has power. And, uh, you know, it's just every day something new is coming out about Diddy. And uh, so, um, you know, it's hard to believe this, these things are not true because, you know, things coming out every day about this guy <laughs> Uh, you know diddy you know whether it be uh, music rights or sexual assault and so you know y'all let me know what y'all think about this because this is get out getting out of hand you know people really coming out you know is it a greek thing where people is coming out about diddy you know y'all let me know you know leave a comment <laughs> what y'all think about these things you know uh it's just it's just crazy you know all these things coming out all at once um 
you know, people think that, you know, did it just need to go to jail to learn a lesson? You know, all these things um, that he went, you know, all these things is coming back to him. And so, you know, let me know what you think. Leave a comment uh, under this video. Very interesting lawsuit. And uh, I, wonder, I, I wonder, you know, what the outcome is going to be with this, this lawsuit. And so appreciate y'all for watching. Continue to subscribe to my channel. Uh, music tips and reviews with JG. Like I said, very interesting lawsuit. You know, Cassie did receive $30 million. And so we, we wonder what's, you know, did he going to be broke? You know, a lot all of these people, you know, coming out on him. So, you know, leave your comments. Leave, leave your comments. Uh, what you think about this, you know. <laughs> Some people think, you know, a surviving Diddy might come out, um, produced by 50, 50 Cent. And so, uh, yeah, appreciate y'all for watching. And that's the next time. All right, peace.